Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be discussing what the best diet is to lose weight. So I started losing weight in December 2019 and I stopped dieting about March, April time. I had done intermittent fasting during this time as well. So there are various different types of diets that I could have possibly done, such as the low fat diet, low carb, Mediterranean, paleo. I could have even done a weight loss program. but I didn't choose any of these diets specifically as I felt that there were downsides to all of them and that I wouldn't be able to sustain the diet or my weight afterwards. So I didn't do a low fat diet, for example, as I felt that it would make me become like restrictive with the foods that I was eating. I didn't want to be obsessed with calorie counting either and I don't really like looking at calories. I also didn't do the low carb diet as I really like carbs. Um, I love pastas, bread, noodles, everything like that and I didn't feel like doing this diet would benefit me that much because after I had lost the weight I would just go back to eating carbs. I just didn't think that I would be able to sustain it. So there's also the Mediterranean diet that I found out about. And I didn't do this diet because of the fact that you would be eating fish and seafoods regularly. And I like to eat fish once in a while, not that often. Also with the fact that a lot of fish are swallowing plastics um, in the ocean, and microplastics. and. I didn't want to be eating fish that had plastics in them often because they'll be doing more harm than good. I didn't want to do like a weight loss program because I feel that I would be relying on it and I wouldn't be able to sustain the weight afterwards. So I eventually decided to do two diets. I put them together. I done intermittent fasting and I ate plant-based. I thought that eating plant-based would be extremely hard, but I eventually found out that it wasn't as hard as I thought that it would be. I didn't just eat fruits and vegetables. I included other um, foods into my diet. But I did reduce a, a few foods and foods groups as well. So for example, I stopped eating meat during that time. So about four, for four months, I didn't eat any meat at all. I wanted to become a vegetarian. And I decided that during this time, it would be good to change my relationship with food altogether. I also didn't eat dairy as I realised that I'm lactose intolerant during that time, which wasn't fun at all. The best diet to lose weight, I would say, would be to eat plant-based. I was able to sustain it nearly a year later, my 13 kg weight loss. And I also implemented other things. So I didn't just do intermittent fast and eat a plant-based. I also reduced the amount of sugar that I ate, even though I wasn't particularly a fan of sugary foods.
I reduce the amount of salt that I ate as well. Um, for example, I reduce the amount of seasonings I had in the foods that I was making. And I cut out having fizzy drinks and juices altogether. So the only things that I drank during this four month period was water and herbal drinks. So having lavender tea, peppermint tea, chamomile tea, those are the types of drinks that I was having. I did. have any green tea because of caffeine and I didn't want to become reliant on that. I also um, stopped eating processed foods. So This, I think, really improved my diet and helped me to lose weight because you don't know what's actually in these processed foods. So it's done well being able to say okay so I think that the best diet is to eat plant-based and to apply it with intermittent fasting that's great and everything but it's not only just about eating a certain way it's also about okay so what else can I do what is needed when losing weight is a mentality shift you need to have a growth mindset that you can actually achieve this weight loss goal you can actually lose the weight that you want to lose without feeling that you have to restrict the foods that you want to eat so the types of things that you can also do is working out if you don't like to work out what you can do is yoga or zumba or meditation those were the types of things that i done during my weight loss journey every single day i didn't want to have to work out and i didn't always like doing ab workouts or leg workouts whatever it was and just want something that's a lower pace so I think doing these types of workouts will be really beneficial and they also help with your mindset I think to make you feel more calm and to not be so conscious about the number that's going to appear on the scale. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Please like, comment and subscribe and you can check out my Instagram at Blossom Made It where I post IG reels on the foods that I'm currently eating. Bye! Thank you.